So this is the finished TetraStream device. It's just a Lyratron tactile shield on top of a modern device Fluximusense shield on top of an Arduino. And um, I went through all the trouble of cutting the pins short on these two buttons that were uh, that were touching the USB jack and, and putting some tape on it and stuff. Well, it looks like when it's on the Fluximusense shield, um, it doesn't even matter. But uh, it works really well. Um, the music that you're hearing right now actually is uh, an old example uh, of the same software that I've since upgraded in numerous ways. Um, but the music you're hearing is actually written entirely by a computer, uh, by a device like this. Um, so I'm pretty excited of where this is going. Uh, basically, uh, I want to see where I can get different sources of random numbers. Uh, I've been playing around with uh, getting random data from nuclear deterioration from a Geiger counter. Um, I'm going to probably input that into this. Uh, though I do like the repeatability of a pseudo random number generator where you can turn a knob and um, it will, you can find the same seed that you had before and it'll give you the same sequence. But uh, this is a fun little toy. Probably be releasing maybe the second version of it if I if I uh, upgrade it a little bit. Well, I don't know. It works okay as it is. But um, yeah, I hope you guys have fun with these things. I think they're pretty awesome. And I'll be releasing the TetraStream source code. Uh, it's going to become an open source project very soon, and I'm eager to see what you guys do with it.